Hey guys, this is Mike over at Androidian Revolution. You can also follow us on Twitter at AndroRev. Today we'll be going over the online cloud-based system called OnLive, just released for the tablets on December 10th. Uh, I did have this on my previous devices, the Evo 3D and also the uh, Nexus S 4G. Overall, it was very good uh, on both devices, but strongly re recommended for a uh, good internet connection, either 4G or also on Wi-Fi recommended as well. Um, since it is all cloud-based, no extra spaces needed on your device or anything else. Um, so we'll just go to the quick interface and kind of show you everything about this real quick. Pretty cool interface, how it starts up. Interesting. As you can see, we have an arena, profile, marketplace, showcase. I'm not going to go through it all, as you can see it all. Go real quick to the arena. Arena, this is pretty much all their online uh, cloud-based games that they carry for the actual device. Or I should say for the application, sorry. Um, so let's say, let's go to a uh, game real quick. Uh, Saints Row the Third, let's check that out. Kind of interesting. Try to adjust the brightness here a little better. But kind of cool. You can go through. Uh, also, I don't know if you can see me. See my zoom into that real quick. Um, you can also get extra options, profiles, add as friend. Um, you can also play with them, and also get the thumbs up or down if you like what they do or don't do. So let's go ahead and go back one real quick. Uh, check out one more game, and we'll go back to the the main menu real quick. Check out Mafia 2. Interesting. Cool nonetheless. All online. So let's go ahead and go back to the main menu here. We have the showcase as well real quick. We'll just go there. It just pretty much shows, you know, as you can see, turn your tablet into a smartphone, gaming console. So anyways, we'll go back. Just pretty much updates for the game itself. Last play shows what we last played, of course. Um, you know, brag clips. We don't have any brag clips, at least I don't have any brag clips right now. Uh, and brag clips is anything we can record online that we may like, and I'll get to that here in a second. Friends, of course, if we have any friends online, we can add friends or find any friends. Uh, of course, my games, which when you download the uh, application for the tablet, you do get the Lego Batman for free, so you don't have to worry about that. It's kind of cool. You don't have to pay for that. Um, but we'll go ahead and go to the marketplace and I'll show you a quick game that I, I particularly like. Um, this is Dirt 3. But as you can see, there is some games, of course, that you do have to pay for. It's a lot cheaper than most of the games you can uh, get uh, for the Xbox or anything like that. Uh, so we'll go to Dirt 3. If I really wanted to purchase that, that was only 6 bucks. As you can see, you have an arena, brag clips, extras, achievements. Um, you can also play with the remote control, which I'm reply purchase for $49.99. Um, but you also get you know different passes and full and stuff like that. The full game itself is $49.99, but three-day trials, or three-day play passes, I should say, is $5.99. So we'll go to free trial real quick. But overall, worth it in my opinion. Um, like I said, on live is in my opinion the next not really next gen gaming system but also uh, at least the next gen online gaming system um, probably the one of its kind so we'll try to skip through this real quick as you can see here at the bottom which I'll get to here in a second you got a keypad which pops up right there you can also go back and forward and then you also have you going back to menu and this is where you can record to do your bragging rights and all that good stuff we'll go ahead and just uh, get to the uh, good stuff so I'm sure you want to see what the gameplay looks like come on pretty responsive like I said even for just an online play just keep that in mind uh, gotta have that 4G connection or better because if not the gameplay itself will be uh, pretty poor I've got a great feeling about this. If 
If you're ready to start the Dirt Tour, the first championship series is waiting for you. Or you can also check out multiplayer. Come on. Totally awesome racing. What will it be? Let's just do a single player quick. Single race. Doesn't matter. We're gonna pick all that, but we're just gonna get down to it. Let's go. I'm just go. And considering the game is online, um, graphics are pretty decent for the most part, in my opinion. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell considering I'm recording this off my my phone. Uh, but overall, well worth the money. Well worth the uh, time and effort. Um, this is only going to get better in my opinion over time as well. You got your accelerate, your handbrake, you look back, you gear up, um, all right there. Your steer. So let's see how well I do. I don't want to look like a fool. Probably will anyways. Like I said, it's not too bad. You gotta have a pretty decent internet connection. Oh, they're walking into the walls. As you can see, not too bad overall. Not a lot of hiccups, not a lot of glitches or tearing in the screen considering it's all online. Like I said, no CDs, no nothing else, no extra memory besides the app needed on your device. It is free to set up an online account as well. The only thing that costs is the actual games itself if you want the game. Uh, but overall experience is very pleasing. So let's go ahead and just go ahead and go back. You guys seen enough of me play here, so go back. As you can see on the menu here, you do get extra controls for service. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. Again, sorry for the video. Quick launch, I got my Lego Batman. Settings, audio, video, notifications, privacy, email notifications. You saw can also do Facebook sharing if you want to. Uh, but like I said, overall, a very good, good service get messages for all your friends and everything else and also achievements and can't really see that but you can also click on it and it shows you there it goes focusing back what I got the achievement on stuff like that so but again this is Mike again from Androidian Revolution thanks again for uh, following this uh, and thanks again for everything else guys take it easy later